Hi everybody and welcome to Gaze of the Week. My name is Ryan and I'm your host. I'm just kidding, I don't talk like that. Um, welcome to another week. Fuck, and I'm already out of things to say. All I have is hello. Shine bright like Orion. I took that from my friend Simon. Shine bright like Simon. Sorry, Simon. I feel like Susan Sarandon and stepmom when she's like, Kay, hey, want to go to a concert? And Jul it was Julia Roberts' idea, and she asked if she could take the stepdaughter to the concert, and Susan Sarandon asked her instead. She's like, it was a really good idea, thank you. And Julia Roberts is like, you mother of my stepchildren but she wanted to say something else. It's chilly here in LA. What's the weather like in your parts? There's this funny viral video going around where LA news anchors are all like, it's freezing. Dangerously cold weather. And it's like in the 50s and the high 40s. It's on Jimmy Kimmel. You should check it out. It's really funny. Just Google it. I might link it. Also take a look at this, a video I'm working on uh, for my Love Don't Hate nonprofit series. The nonprofit part of me is called Love Don't Hate. It's a simple, honest message that can be applied to almost anything. Any situation you're in, it's simple. Love, don't hate. And that's kind of what I live by. It prevents you from getting mad. It prevents you from doing anything that infringes upon anyone else's rights, from being negative, from being hurtful, just, yeah. Anyway, so Zilla Banks tweeted Perez Hilton. We were all on Twitter. Well, you know the Twitter feed. You feel like you're like on something with people and you're all like tweeting back and forth at each other. Anyway, Zilla Banks is like, she says the word, the F word, which I don't repeat. But you know what I'm talking about, it rhymes with maggot. A lot of us saw it and we were tweeting back at her and we were like, what are you talking about, Azila? And then she started saying like, I didn't mean gay man, I meant any male who acts like a female. And then we were like, how is that any better? Stop digging a hole, what are you talking about? Anyway, so I was like, guys, hold on, let's wait and see if she can learn something from this. Let's give her the benefit of the doubt. You know, she might not know what she's talking about. Next day, she's like, I stand by it and I meant what I said. And so I was like, oh, okay, Azila, this isn't over. And so I'm making a video called Azila Banks, Love Don't Hate, and I'm telling her why it's so wrong to use hate speech like that, especially when she's bisexual. It's like, unnecessary. So check out a little preview here. Dear, that's gonna be so much fun. I'm gonna try and finish it as soon as possible, but editing has gotten hard. And that's another thing I wanna talk to you guys about time. Lately I've been feeling as if there isn't enough, and I know that's a lot of people feel that way, but significantly not enough. As in like, I wake up in the morning and then like, I look at my watch, if my watch actually worked, it's just an accessory, and then I'm like, oh my god, it's time to go to bed. When I used to be in school, or when I used to be a lifeguard, I would look at my, I would look at the clock all day and I would be like, oh I can't wait to get out, oh my god, when will this be over? You know that feeling like time takes forever to pass? I now feel, I can't remember the last time I felt that way. And I don't know if it's because I'm getting older or if it's because I've gotten so insanely busy that I just, I have no sense of time anymore. And that's been on my mind a lot lately, so I'd appreciate your input. Is that normal? Are y'all feeling that way too? Or should I like take it down a notch? Anyway, next week I will be uploading on Saturday or Sunday because Monday we have a huge announcement for you. My question for the week is gonna be, I love lamp. Gaze of the week has been on almost three years. How long have you been watching? Answer down below and let me know. Thank you so much for watching. Have a fabulous rest of the week and don't forget to watch the rest of the gaze. Okay, bye. Oh shit, Miles is serving up beers. Miles just got stale. <laughs> Shake it, Scott. I can. Sing it to the bad guy. Scott, you're gonna break something. <laughs> <laughs>